your boy Sense. What up? Fake famous and it's been itch. Um, over here fucking with Ableton real quick. I wanted to show y'all some new shit. I'm fucking with. Uh, play a little bit of some new audio, but also get into some new video. So, um, I've been kind of diving into the visual aesthetic and the visual side of things lately. Um, using a piece of software called Visible that basically responds to the music that I'm playing to offer a visual experience uh, for those that are peeping the show. So this is something that I want to start bringing to stages in 2014. Kind of testing the water, seeing what y'all think about it. So let's launch something from the AP real quick. Now Visible is set up in, you know, in conjunction with Ableton, like I said. It responds off of a few things. Uh, some of the dynamics of my song are going to change things. And this webcam is actually going to feed the video that we use. So the webcam right on my computer actually affects what goes on here. This is going to be the video used to route everything using a plugin called Grabber. Shout out to what that, that is, by the way. But for producers looking to bring a visual aesthetic to their performances, it's nice because you can set up a lot of the effects, kind of like you do MIDI clips. Um, and have them run in the background so you can focus just on your music while the videos do alterations on the fly. You see some of these kind of time-based movements here. These are programmed with clips. Let's take it over here real quick. This is just this video clip. Some automation being run. Same for this one. So you've got all these really responsive uh, visual cues without you really having to do anything but perform as you normally would. Fake famous, fake famous, fake famous, Ha. Peace.